Hi, everyone. Thank you for joining us for week 10 of the watch list. We will challenge. If you're not sure what this challenge is, go ahead and check out the video description of this video. And we've got the page and posts linked there for you. So as I, um, I'm going to go ahead and start us off by navigating to the watch list. Uh, Pam, then you maybe you can explain what our challenge is this week. So just go right. to my my wiki tree and then watch list. Oh, but this week, what are we doing? We're going well, to go this week. Else. This week is all about what wiki tree kindly calls suggestions. They're really a sort of an error message of a way that you could improve your profile. You can get to it this way, the way that Azure is showing you on the screen right now. You can also um, get it on, on, the, uh, on the profile page or on the watch list page. But you're going to get to this suggestions report for managed profiles. And if this isn't something you've done before, you're going to come unglued because you're going to have a lot of them. But most of them are very quick to fix. So they come in, um, in two groups. One of them is a general list at the top. These are kind of complicated. And when people are not used to working with these, I often suggest that they start with the second group at the bottom of the page. But since we're here, we'll talk about them. Um, these, it tells you what the error is, which profile it's on, the nature of the um, problem, and there's a little red box with an arrow in it that if you need it to, it will take you to a video that shows you how to fix that particular problem as a sample. So somebody went through and did this for all the different error messages a couple of years ago, and they're fabulous. Sometimes you push that button, you go to that video, you watch it, and you go, oh, okay, I get that. Sometimes it's really complex, it's very advanced, and you need to ask for assistance. So um, don't beat yourself up too much if you can't fix every one of these. There are data doctors and people on G2G who will help you, but these are important to fix. So they'll say difficulty easy, difficulty advanced. So um, look through and see what you can do. The group at the bottom will be a lot easier for you to fix and will get you kind of used to this process. Is there anything else? Oh, excuse me. Is there anything else you want to say about these ones at the top, Azure, before we look at the find a grave ones? Nope, I'm good. Okay. The bottom, the second bunch, there might be one in the middle with unusual names, but that's pretty self-explanatory. Um, but the one, the group at the bottom is things that find a grave has identified as possible connections or maybe you forgot to put in a birth date a death date a location and it will give you a prod to fix that and you don't just automatically just do it because it says to but if you look at it and you say oh yeah i typed 28 october and it should have been 26 october you can just make that change but if it doesn't quite make sense to you or doesn't seem right you say gee this says pennsylvania i thought he died in massachusetts um, you might have to do a little research before you complete it but you just click on the profile that you manage it will open up and you can see the error and i always scroll down to the bottom of the profile there'll be a reminder there and if you're in the edit mode on your profile there'll be a reminder down there that says, oh, you're looking at the birth date and it says the wrong thing. And that kind of helps me remember what I'm trying to do. So see that little hint, find a grave. So whatever it is, there'll be a little hint there and then you can, you can fix it in the profile and then report the status over on the right that it has been fixed or you can click on that fixed button. But especially after a big event like the Connectathon, if you participated, you're going to have a bunch of these. But they're very quick to do. So you can clean them up, and it makes our tree so much stronger. Does it, Azure, do you want to add anything to that? Nope. I'm just going to go ahead and do this uh, fix here. Mm -hmm. Minor correction. It just was a merged uh, memorial on Find a Grave. I put in 
save memorial ID and I'm going to mm -hmm. hit full save commit changes. Mm -hmm. Close out of there. And then you either hit the fixed button at the bottom or you hit the status button on that original page to let the system know that you fixed it. So yeah, I'm just going to click status. Corrected and update status. Mm -hmm. So the official challenge, which as you can see, we're not real strict about the rules of the challenge, is to fix five of these. But if you find you have a whole bunch of them, let me urge you to keep working on them to get them cleaned up because these affect other people who work on profiles and it's so important to keep this clean. I know that on Tuesday this gets updated and I try to check in on Tuesday or Wednesday and see what my suggestions are and clean them up. Um, so I would recommend that you sort of establish that as a, as a pattern and a habit because um, this will help everybody. And we have linked here uh, showing on the uh, bottom of the screen, the project Data Doctors, if you're interested in joining that project and kind of learning more about helping us to keep the database clean, um, that's uh, definitely something you could check out and join. That's actually one of the first projects I joined so I could learn more about how everything worked behind the scenes. So check that out. And if we're done, I'll go ahead and share that on the space page for this week's challenge, they'll be linked here at the top and down here at the bottom, a link to the G2G where you can share what you worked on. If you come across anything interesting or if you have any questions, you can share that there. Uh, thank mm -hmm. you so much for tuning in. If you're late to the challenge, you can still participate. You can go back to the main challenge post and page, which is linked here at the top of the page here. And here's the post. You can just click on that and answer that post to join the challenge. Think about following this tag, Watchlist Weevils, to be alerted to new G2G content. Subscribe to our channel on YouTube to get alerted to new content there. And just tune in each Wednesday at 10.30 a.m. Eastern. And we'll be sharing that week's challenge. Thank you for joining us and we'll see you next week. See you around the tree.